Look at this. Pull that back, and now I can open the- Whoa! Oh, <laughs> wow, okay. Hello, and welcome back to Mirrorforge, this time for part three. And this time, we know what we've done. We know we have certain regrets, certain guilt, and maybe it's going to get used against us. But our mission remains the same. We are looking for Jill. I don't think that was Jill, but there was definitely something. Right. Okay, there's a frozen moment there, but I'm actually wondering what that was. Right, let's get this out and let's see. Ugh. Hold it! Hurry up and barricade that door! Don't you fucking let that get inside! Son of a bitch! Oh my god, they're coming through the walls! Right, yeah. Interdimensional beings rarely play by the rules, as it turns out. <laughs> they can do pretty much whatever they want. Right. And I'm gonna do whatever I want. I'm gonna crawl through here. So yeah, don't know where I am, but we are still looking for Jill. <laughs> Not you. Are we gonna find her in this video? Let's hope so. Let's hope so. This way? Alright. Bloody hell, what happened to you? Are you the other half of the body that I saw assimilated with the wall last time? Maybe. Right, okay, not going that way, I guess. And that doesn't seem to be working. Right, okay, the mirror it is. Where are we going? Whoa! What the hell? The mirror doesn't seem to be working anymore. Right. <laughs> Hang on, are you sure about that? Maybe it's not working the way you intended, but something definitely happened. Right, okay, so... Okay, we can't go through there. I hear someone crying, though. Are we going back on ourselves? Oh boy. What's that? Wait. Right, it was the light up there. It's the fan spinning. That's what I saw on the door. Did this just unlock? Right, okay. Looks like we're going this way. Looks like we're going down. Jill? You down here? <laughs> Probably not, but uh, I'm gonna enjoy looking for you either way, I think. Right. What about this mirror? I can't even try and use that one. Right, let's just keep on following the blood, let's keep on going down, and let's keep on looking for Jill in this very obviously Silent Hill-inspired area. Oh, hello. Oh, it's you! You're the one that chased me into this dimension, aren't you? I'm finally getting a good look at you. Weird. Creepy. Can't go through. Fuck. I need to find a way to turn it off. Right. Well, let's hope that the way to turn it off is somewhere through here. Near these painkillers. Right. Okay. Oh, no, no, it's not okay at all. Uh. I'm gonna want to use this. Unfortunately, when I've got this out, I can't see where I'm going. So. Uh, there's a couple of doors. Hmm. Let's maybe go on the left side over here. Let's see. Okay. No, that's not working. No. No. Okay. Oh boy. All right. Up and over the bath. <laughs> okay. Oh. All right. Is the drawer whispering to me? There is something in it. Vaguely written in the corner, 4500 BC, outskirts of Europe. Right. Isn't that the statue used in The Exorcist? <laughs> it looks like it. Cool. Right. Yeah, we're obviously dealing with a very ancient power here. Okay. Oh. Oh, here we go. That should have cleared the way back there. Oh, brilliant. Okay. Right. So we just need to head back. Right. Uh, you guys can't jump, can you? Good, good. Let's keep it that way. Alright, let's see. This way, no. More painkillers. Okay, I'll take them. Oh boy, right. Here they come. Up and over. Right, let's close the door. Okay, right. And down we go again. We're continuing our descent. Alright. How far down do we need to go exactly? At least one more flight. Oh, is that it? I 
think we might be at the ground floor now. Is it just the dead end? Y no, I don't think it is actually. Hang on. Oh, oh, looks like there might be a frozen moment. And a statue. Hey, there you go. Right. We will use Jill's molecular energy to escape this reality. Yeah, I know it'll kill her. I know. But we have no other choice. If the cultists get to her, the demon will not just utterly devastate our world. It'll devour the multiverse. This way, at least she'll die for a worthy cause. Saving what's left of us. Wow. Okay, well, I suppose we want to prevent that from happening. Maybe, maybe I need to step into her shoes. Maybe I need to take the hit for her, you know? Maybe that's the way the story is going to go. Maybe that's how I'm going to redeem myself. I'm locked in. Brilliant. Okay. Oh, I am actually locked in. All right, what we got down here? Something in the drawer? Oh, there is. An old book. Anunnaki, gods of ancient Mesopotamia. Sumerian civilization, 3500 BC. Gods? Aliens? Unlocked doors? <laughs> Interdimensional beings is underlined. Yeah, that's what they settled on. Right. Okay. A fire safety door. That amount of blood does not make me think of safety. Alright. Don't like the sound of that. I can't go back. How do we get this open? Do I need to get this one open instead? Oh. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Right. Okay, go, 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 go. That's that thing, isn't it? Oh bloody hell. Alright, here we go. Wait. Whoa. Whoa, boy. Alright, here we go. That's that thing that I saw at the end of the last video. Oh man, right. Bit of an obstacle course here. Right. Where are we? Okay, right. What's this? Oh shit. Oh. Okay, okay. You got me, fair and square. I died. Okay. I think I had the right idea. I think I need to rush over there. I need to hit that button, and then I need to head to the right. On the right, we've got to hit that real quick. And then go here. Okay, brilliant. Right, up and over. Good stuff. What next? What do we do? Run to the left. Uh, left again. Okay, yeah. Left is better than right, surely. Okay, through the door. Oh, oh. Are we safe? I think we're safe. Right. 2003. The year I woke up. Can't remember a thing before it. Right. Wallet in my pocket said my name was Thomas Jackson. And somehow, I knew medicine. Hmm. And that's all you know? Oh. Alright. <laughs> Some doors open when they want to be opened, it seems. Well, there you go. I got my adrenaline levels up. That was pretty fun. England's a newborn, it's Oh, hey again! Blood of angels run into my It's been a while. Eternal cries of the unborn, ripped from ether before taking form. Such things are commonplace torment. True desolation is far more insidious. Right. Yeah, it's been a while since we heard from you. That wasn't to be believed. Uh, maybe let's close that up, yeah. <laughs> Alright. You got something down here? Let's have a look. Nothing? Nothing. Alright. Ooh. Okay. Why are we even considering starting it again? The mirror forge was activated three times in the past. Every single time! Reality cracked and some fucked up shit came through. <laughs> this is goddamn insanity. Yes, it is. I agree wholeheartedly. Turn back the clock to before a time you remember. Okay. Hmm. Is that why we just saw 2003? But what, what time would that be, though? I don't know. There's a few clocks over here. I don't know if I can change the time, though, unfortunately. Right, let's just keep on going, shall we? Oh boy. What the hell is going on there? It's devouring someone by the looks of it. Ah. Oh. <laughs> I can barely see, unfortunately. Right. 
Around here. Okay. Do we need to pull this? No, not this time. That's not gonna work. Another statue? Okay. What's the catch? Binds of time. Shackles of space. My own box. No escape. No new agony. I must find my Whoa. salvation. All right. Is that your salvation through there? Let's go take a look, shall we? Hey, oh! Come back here, you little... Okay, this is new, isn't it? Okay, yeah, this has changed a little bit, hasn't it? Is anyone else reminded of, you know, games by Vetus? <laughs> when you hear a voice like that? Okay, now this one I can interact with. Let's see. Okay, so we just have to click on the hand specifically, and then we can uh, sort that out. I don't know. I don't know at all. Um, yeah, they all seem to be at different times. There's got to be something to this, right? To see the way forward, you must look back. Let's see. On, on the backs of these? Actually, hang on. There's a clock here. Oh. It's a strange old alarm clock. It only has a minute hand. Aha! Okay, so that needs to be seven, I think. But what about the hour? Hmm. There you go. I mean, I guess I can trial and error this, but I'd actually like to find the hour hand if possible. Can we get the boards off of this? Oh, hang on. Ah, look, there it is. It's a nine. It's a nine. I actually do want that crowbar. Right, okay, so let's set the hour hand to nine. Like that. Okay, that's probably a good sound in context, right? Are the boards off? No. No. Was that door open before? I don't think the door was open before. Hang on, hang on. Let me go back round here. Alright. That's still locked. But that is now wide open. Brilliant, okay. Alright. Another frozen moment. Here it is. How could I have been so blind? Everything was written on the ancient Sumerian tablets. They believed it was a godly entity. We know it's an interdimensional being, omnipresent and all-powerful. Right. Yeah. That's who I'm up against. <laughs> and the stakes are pretty high. Yeah, lucky me, eh? Lucky me. What's this at the end? What the? What the indeed? It's a... It's a hand? Oh, that's my hand! With the mark that I've got on my palm, right? Huh. Okay. So I can't... Oh, I can't take it. Oh, right. Oh, yeah. I'm getting that feeling of being watched again. Let's get out of this area, shall we? Oh. Well, the boards have been taken down. I need to find the other piece. What? Oh, oh, I see. Oh, it looks like there's uh, three other pieces to whatever this is. Okay, some sort of drawing. Right, okay. Well, let's have a little look, shall we? Um, I guess it's going to be somewhere around this area. Is there something down here now? No, still nothing. Oh, in the locker? That's one. Yeah, maybe I could glue it together with the other pieces. There's another one. There you go. Right. Have I found all the pieces? I think I may have found all the pieces. Let's see. Right, so... Um... Is it gonna be that corner? Okay, that... That fits. No, I don't think it's that one. That one, maybe? And then that goes there. Right. Now I can see it. It's a strange sketch. It is oh. the devourer of realities. 
The Anunnaki locked it up in an eternal prison, but the key to that prison could only be carried by a human bearer. Ah. Someone special, too. Someone so special that it sets them apart as alone in the multiverse. Doesn't happen very often. <laughs> this thing, it nearly destroyed this reality. Don't give it the chance to do so again. I'll do my best. Alright? Okay. Oh. This door's open now. Right, okay. Oh, hello. <laughs> uh, anything down here? No? Really? Okay. Just looking for any prompts. I keep seeing you. I keep seeing you. What's this? I was a young fool when he first imprisoned me. Banished to the 503rd layer of the abyss, Toromor. By my own lover, the one I never thought could even dream my betrayal. I sunk claws into the flesh of titans, made ladders from their backs, and crawled towards salvation. I was hungry. So hungry I grew careless. They locked me away in my own feeding grounds. This time, I will not stop to savour the agony. There'll be none left to banish me a third time. Wow, alright. Whoa, okay! I've been called many names by your kind. Is that right? Ah. But only seven of them are true. Okay. Lilith, the mash too. Dim. I see. All right. We're not going that way, are we? Right. Um. Can we? Can we get out of this area? No. Oh, we're locked in again. Okay. What do I need to do then? What do I need to find? It's got to be something, right? Maybe there is something down here. Can I open the drawers? Oh, there's a valve. That does seem to be doing something. Oh, a secret doorway in a dimension like this. <laughs> I see you have taste. Oh boy. Right, we have another mirror. Is this one going to work? I think so. Right, where are we now? Back in Gorberg? Potentially. Hey, oh, hello. Thomas? What the hell are you doing here? Who are you? Sorry, man. Not trying to trouble you. I'm just trying to get to something called the Forge. Wait, uh, how do you know my name? Yeah. Of course, you won't remember. Uh, the Mirror Forge Blast. The transition barrier to other dimensions heavily affects your mind. Like what an EMP does to electronics. Oh. You remember nothing of your past life. What the fuck are you talking about? Uh, you were born here, Thomas. In this dimension. Oh. You were part of Project Mirror Forge. You were our doctor. Ah! Well, that much I figured out. Oh, right. The Anunnaki, uh, gods from 3500 BC, ancient Mesopotamia, are well, interdimensional, all powerful beings. When the Mirror Forge was activated, we caused a crack in the multiverse. Um, uh, we fucked it up. <laughs> Wait, so. <laughs> That's an understatement. More specifically, it. Uh, it was like a, um, a hammer, causing a crack in the prison of the primordial demoness, Lamashtu, the devourer of realities. The Anunnaki locked her up. The only way to open the cage is a key. All right. That, or just smashing her dimension in, into ours until enough cracks open for her to slither through. Mm. How do you... But what I can't figure out is how you got the mark of Anu, the prime god infused on your palm. It's the key that unlocks her prison. Right. If she gets you, not just this reality, but all realities will be consumed by her. Wow. Whoa, whoa, wait. Hold up. Stop for a second. I got this in a car accident two years ago. <laughs> oh. oh, really? Yeah, ever seen a, a scar? bear so much resemblance to the cuneiform symbol of Anu, Thomas. <laughs> Wonder why you can seemingly hop dimensions? No. no. No, no, That's the mark of Anu. It does explain where you went 20 years ago. <laughs> I honestly just thought you were dead. 
How do you know all this? How do I know you're not just another trick? Good point. I know because I was there. We were uh, friends once, and all things considered, it it is good to see you, Thomas. But but listen to me. Lamashtu must not find you. Right. Just look at what she's done to our reality, and this is just a fraction of her true power. But but she can't fully escape without the mark of Anu. Go back now. I can't do that. They took Joe. The woman I love. I took an oath to protect her. And I failed that once. I won't let her suffer again because of me. You were once willing to sacrifice all of us for the dreams of some madman. And now you're going to sacrifice the whole world for some woman? Apparently. I can still save her. There's nothing else to discuss. Oh boy. It's the Thomas I know. Okay, go back the way you came. This way is blocked. And Thomas, it's, maybe it's better. You don't remember. Holy shit. Okay, well thanks for that info dump. (laughs) So, remember what I said about it being high stakes? Well, the stakes are even higher now. About as high as you can possibly go. Look at this. The Mirror Forge does not respect space and time. All these activations caused... The Tunguska event, Roanoke Colony, Mary Celeste, the Devil's Womb Canyon, the recent one. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. And he's right, we can't go through here. Oh boy, what's he doing here still? Hoping to fix it all, I guess? Right, okay. I don't think there is anything else for us to do apart from go back. Can we do that? Seems like we can. Man, okay. So, uh, yeah, the fate of all realities rest in my hands. <laughs> oh boy. And now this door is open, right. I'm definitely not going back, am I? Right. Let's see then. How am I gonna do this? This way? Alright, let's see. There's more blood to follow. Ooh. Oh, I thought that was a mirror. <laughs> Oh god, look at that. Yeah, no thanks. <laughs> I choose life. Alright, let's see. I'm probably gonna have to go back that way. But, uh, I'm curious. Ooh. Someone's trying to get out. Let's get out of here. Oh boy, there you are again. Is that meant to be Lilith? Maybe I could if I had a keycard, though. We're looking for a keycard, are we? Okay. Uh, maybe I'm going to find it through that door ahead of me or the one to the left. Okay, thankfully it's still locked. Right. There's just a few spiders, right? We've even got some painkillers. Two of them, in fact. Is it the spider I can hear? Oh, man. That's a strange design. Again, though, thankfully, it looks like they can't jump. Right. Oh, boy. Where are we going? Over there, I suppose? Right. Let's do this. Okay. Ah, jeez. All right. Up here? We're going in here? No. No, boy. Oh. Okay. They can't get to me. They can't get to me. Okay, okay. Right. I guess I'm gonna find a keycard somewhere around here. Oh, hang on. What's that? Oh, I'm gonna want that, aren't I? Okay. There? Does it go over there? Is that where I'm meant to be taking this? Ooh. Okay. Right, hang on, hang on. Put this down here. There's a lever. Looks like it's missing some gears. Ah, right, some gears. I've got one, and it goes there. Okay. Are we looking for another one then? I think so. Right. Oh boy. Right. Uh, I'm just gonna freeze everyone, and I'm gonna have a little look around. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Got it. 
Or at least, I think I do. There we go. Right, sometimes uh, certain things are hard to pick up. Right, a little bit of platforming. No problem. It's as easy as that. Right, so where does that go? Over How there. Do it. Yes! Now to pull the lever. Nice! <laughs> oh, here is the key card. Perfect, okay. Well, I suppose all I need to do is get out of this area, isn't it? Right. Okay, okay. Up and over. Brilliant, right. Let's use one of my many painkillers. Wow, I've got 14 spare. The painkillers actually heal a lot, too, so I'm feeling pretty invulnerable right now, I've got to be honest. <sighs> Honestly, I'm still trying to take in what's going on here. Like, the, the, the truth of it all, the Mirror Forge. This is such a... It's such a cheesy kind of game and story, you know? It's really janky, but I'm enjoying it. I like it because it's goofy. Shit. Michael, it's over. The Seal of Nur is gone. Who the fuck knows where it went? I do. Without it. I can't even try to hop dimensions to get out of here. Hmm. Hmm. There's always the sigils. The sigils? Is that it? That's all you're gonna say? Right, the sigils. Hmm. Oh, really? Well, I never wanted to go back anyway. Uh, it looks like there's a recorder down here. I can't believe we're even considering this. If we do this, we're no better than those madmen that worship her. Bury the sanctimonious bullshit. If they get a hold of the Mark's bearer, that's it for everyone. Lamashtu will be free. We just want to escape to a safer reality. She has a name, you know. It's Jill. And you're talking about killing her. We don't have time for this. We need to take her to Aldred's Manor. People, come on. Let's move. Aldred's Manor. Is that where it all started? Hmm. Maybe. Maybe. Right, there's something else down here as well. Hard to see because it's so bright, but... Right, a cultist of Lamashtu in Gorberg. Right. At least now we know who we're up against. We know a few of her names anyway. Did you say she has seven? Okay. Yeah, thanks for that reminder. Okay. Looks like we've got another frozen moment here. Listen, Thomas, I, I think... I think he's been lying to us. I, I, I know it sounds crazy, but... Ever since we first turned out that fucking machine, Earldred has been obsessed with piercing the veil. And every time we do, it goes to shit. <laughs> Don't you ever wonder what exactly he's seeing through those cracks? Hmm. Look at all this blood. <laughs> well, if this is Silent Hill inspired, I'm definitely reminded of Silent Hill 3. Are we going to find a shotgun around here? Oh, no, we are going to find another frozen moment, though. I just... I need to tell someone. If anything happens to me, just know I didn't do it to myself. Okay? Hmm. I believe you, Jane. I believe you. Uh, looks like there's nothing of note on the train. Let's see. Something down here? Oh, there is actually, yes. Okay, it's a newspaper. It's an autopsy report for specialist Jane Smith, who died on April the 5th, 2003, of a lethal morphine overdose, ruled an accidental death with suspicion of probable suicide. She was suicided. Right, yeah. It wasn't her. She was, uh, she was taken care of. Alright. Let's see. Oh. Up and over we go. Look at this. What was that? Did something come in? Did something break through a rift? Hmm. That's enough of that. Right. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not really fond of these doors anymore. I guess we're not going up there. Maybe through here? Just keep on following these dummies, right? Oh boy. What's this? Through death, purification. 
The Lady of Eternal Twilight, Dim Mi. Daughter of Anu, named by the gods. Victory heroine among ladies, Lamastu, the Exalted. Caesar of the Asaku, South Wind. Would these be her names? Hmm. Right. Through here? Yep, looks like it. Is that supposed to be me? It's... It's a painting of Jacob Eldred. Hmm, alright. <laughs> Is that me? I d <laughs> are we the same person? Uh, so let's see. CEO of Firm Atomic, Jacob Eldred, begins his Mirrorforge project to solve the world's most pressing need, saving the environment through clean, renewable energy. Eldred's Mirrorforge is reported to use a proprietary technology to tap into previously undiscovered sources of horror. Yeah, let me finish that off. Sources of horror. Alright. Oh. Oh. It's the subway station getting overrun. Is that it? That's all we get to see? Oh man, alright. <laughs> okay, hang on. Well, there's nothing behind this one, so are we going... Oh, we we might be going up. Let's see. Where am I going to place this? Right here, apparently. Okay, let's do this. Alright. Up we go. Nope, hang on. <laughs> let's try that again. Alright. Seems a bit awkward. Okay. And we're through. Alright. Ah, look at this. Pull that back, and now I can open the- WHOOSH! <laughs> wow, okay. Alright. I wasn't expecting that. Okay, is there anything else in here? Okay, there's a lever. What did that do? The safety door at the front of the train should be open now. Oh, right, right. So, are we boarding the train? Sounds like we might. Alright, so back this way. Let's see then. This one here? Hmm. Must be the... Oh, it's... <laughs> it's uh, it's these guys again. It must be the other side that we need to go to. Right. These guys are, are so clumsy. In fact, they're probably too clumsy. I don't know if I even need to stun them. Yeah. There you go. Just outrunning them. Down the tracks we go. Not too far, though. Alright. Up here? Right. Where's this going to take me? <laughs> Dread XP, yeah? Alright. I'm hearing something. Can this be believed? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, this game's goofy, but I love it. I never know what I'm going to see on the other side of the door, you know? Alright. Does this mirror work? No, no. And what is that door? Oh, we're using this, are we? Alright. I can't believe we were so, so wrong. We weren't just tapping into a plane of infinite power. We were tapping into a thing. There's something on the other side whispering. I, I can't believe I was so blind. Jane. Jane was right. <laughs> Earldred is leading us to damnation. And now... She's dead. She is indeed, unfortunately. Right, I think we're meant to go that way, so let's try this door. Ah, it doesn't work. Okay. There's nothing else to find here. I don't believe so. Okay. Alright, what's this? A little bit different. Oh, alright. Looks like we've got enemies around here. Oh. Oh! Don't step in the light, right? Don't step in the fucking light. Alright, well, I, <laughs> I guess that staircase is out. Goodness gracious me. Right, uh, through here? No, that's not working. Can't access the ladder. Where, where did that thing go? Up there? Right, let's go up here. Let's have a look. Alright. Um, this way? Around here? Hmm. 
think I'm safe. I... No. Whoa, 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 whoa. Now I'm not so sure. Oh boy. Right. Is... Oh, that... That's the thing. Hang on. Is it safe to look at it? Probably not. I might die again. What on earth? Oh god. It's some sort of strange humanoid anglerfish. Right. Okay, so... Yeah, I, I suppose we're gonna have to navigate around the light, aren't we? To what end? Where are we going? Uh, that I'm not so sure about, to be honest. Let's see. I'm gonna wait for it to move, and I'm gonna see if I can track where it moves to. Alright. Seems like he's not really too bothered about me shining my light onto him, but oh boy. Uh, over here? Right. What's this? Oh boy, right, I'm just gonna hide here. I should be safely in the shadow, I hope? Yes? Yes. Okay, good, good. Okay, go, 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 go. Is it safe? Uh, I hope so. Right, back here? Crouch down, okay. Are we alright back here? Are we- Ooh. Oh. Okay. Right, I think I do want to head over there. Okay. Right. I- Oh shit, 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 shit. Okay. I'm just beyond its light, so that's good. Now where are we going? Over here? Okay. Hang on, this, this is where I came from, wasn't it? And of course there's no going back, but right, hang on, if he's moved, if he's looking for me over there, surely he's not looking at the staircase over here. Right, sit- Oh shit! Oh boy. Okay. I- Ooh! I- Ooh! Okay, I- I don't know where I stand with this thing, honestly. Oh, come on, I can't keep doing this. I'm gonna have to make a break for it. Go. Just, just go. Just go. Oh, wow, it worked. Okay, I didn't... Oh, shit! Okay, he's on the move again. He's on the move. <laughs> I gotta get out the light. Okay, hang on. Right, right. There he is. And he's looking in that direction, which probably means we need to go over there. What is that? Is that... Is that a car that I'm seeing? Maybe a reminder of what happened to me? Yeah, I think so. Just look at this guy. Creepy design. Pretty unique as well. Okay. Right, let's see. It's going over there. Alright, I'm gonna I'm gonna hide behind one of the cars. Oh, yep, okay, perfect, perfect. Is it going to go back over there? Yes it is! Okay. Let's keep on going. Right. Where where are we going to, precisely? Can we open up the vent? Nope. Alright. Oh, shit! Oh, it was the light. It was the light. Okay. Uh, are we looking for another button? Because I don't see it. Ah, yes I do. When in doubt, just follow the cable, I suppose, right? Okay, I think it's probably safe. I... Oh, it's moving. It's moving. Oh, that's what I heard. Well, hopefully this is going to be a nice shortcut out of here. <sighs> right. Let's see. Oh, wow. Creepy. You stay on that side, all right? I'll stay on this one. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> is it safe to come out? I, ooh, mm, I don't know. I really don't know. You're up there somewhere. I. Oh, okay. Yeah, it seems when he repositions, he's uh, he's quite erratic with his with his light. When it goes, oh, oh, okay, it's gonna go over there. I, I should be safe here, right? When it goes back over to the left, I guess I'll hide behind this this column, this pillar here. Yeah. Oh, although... 
you know what? It, it would probably be okay, but I did see just like that slim bit of light. And I want to stay out of it. Okay, go, 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 go. What's this? Okay, that... <laughs> something happened. The game saved. I must be doing something right. Where's he gonna go? That way? Ooh. Still looking at me. Come on. That's it. Right. What on earth did I hear? Was it this opening? Okay, hang on, hang on. Here we go, here we go. Right. What are we doing this for, exactly? I haven't really stopped to, to think about what's going on. What the... What was that? Oh. Alright. Oh! Are we okay? Just sitting here? I... Hmm. Right. I, I, I'm, I'm so exposed here. What do I do? Do I go around to the right? Okay. Uh, I guess I could drop down, potentially? Uh, no, I couldn't, actually, because there's an invisible barrier. Never mind. Right. Oh, you're, you're not going to look over here, are you? No. Good, good, good. I think what I probably need to do is hide behind that container. Yes, yes, okay. And then, well, then I'm not really sure. Whoa, okay, he's looking right at me, I think. Okay, go, go, go. I'm gonna hide here. All right. <laughs> Can we go through there? Is that where we're going? There's a mirror up there. Hmm. I don't know if it's safe for us to move. It probably is, but... Right, let's see. Okay. What's this for? Oh! Oh, I see. Oh, that knocked down the mirror! Right! And it... It seems like the mirror's working! Oh! Oh, oh, uh, right. I th have we just gone across the room? I think so, right? Okay, let's avoid the steam. And let's go over here. Oh, careful, careful. <laughs> all right. Right, all these cables. Yeah, have we, have we turned on all the buttons at this point? There he is, over there. He's looking in completely the wrong area. I love it. Right. Okay. We've got a gate here, which is locked, unfortunately. Hmm. Need to find a key. Ah, hang on. No. There's a button here. Right. Let's see. What does it say? Go through the open gates and look for a way out. Okay. Oh, this is where he was before. Hmm. Okay. Let's see then. They're all connected to this, aren't they? Oh, that's opened the door. We just need to go down. Uh, and no, that that's not the way we need to do it. Um, do we need to go back through the mirror, perhaps? Uh, down here? Oh, invisible barrier. <sighs> that would be a lot easier, to be honest, if I could do that. What about this? No, that doesn't work. There's a gap in the fence here. No? Oh, come on. Ah. Ah, there's a ladder. Right, yeah, let's do this properly. We don't need to fall to our deaths. <laughs> Alright. And we're down. Right. Is it safe? I think it's safe. I'm gonna run for it. <laughs> oh. oh boy, okay, right. <laughs> I'm making a run for it. And so is he. Oh, bloody hell. Right, okay, this way. Uh-huh, come on, come on. Over to the right, by the looks of it. Okay, exit. Is it? Oh, okay. Right, are we safe? I think we are. Thank you, fire safety door. Goodness gracious me. Right, a frozen moment. 
You know that even if he manages to escape with the mark of a new, going through dimensions will seriously affect his mind. The blue barrier will most certainly disrupt his consciousness. He'll forget his entire life in this reality. He's right. He's exactly right, because I did. Yeah. Right. Okay, so we went all that way down to go all this way up, did we? And where's this going to go? Is this going to take us to Eldred's Manor? Is this going to take us to Jill? Is this really an exit? Oh, it might be. <laughs> We're loading a new area. All right. Oh boy. Where on earth are we now? Okay, hang on. Another frozen moment. And some more painkillers. We were ambushed on our way to the forge. Seven dead. Five wounded. Only four soldiers in the group managed to get away. I doubt I'll survive the night. The wound's infected. Damn you, Eldred. What have you done? Yes, Eldred, what have you done? We're going to find out in part four. Thank you very much for watching part three. I hope you're still enjoying the series. If you are, leave some support down below. A like, a comment, subscribe, share, something like that. It all helps. See you next time in part four. Interdimensional beings rarely play by the rules, as it turns out. <laughs> Are you the other half of the body that I saw assimilated with the wall last time? Whoa! Maybe that's how I'm going to redeem myself. I'm... Locked in? Brilliant. Do I need to get this one open instead? Oh. Oh shit. Oh fuck. Alright. Ooh. Whoa, okay! We caused a crack in the multiverse. Um, uh, we fucked it up. <laughs> Wait, so... <laughs> That's an understatement. Morse. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not really fond of these doors anymore. Hmm, alright. <laughs> Is that me? <laughs> Are we the same person? To tap into previously undiscovered sources of horror. Yeah, let me finish that off. Sources of horror. Pull that back, and now I can open the- Whoosh! <laughs> oh! Oh! <laughs> oh. I think I'm safe. I... No. Whoa, 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 Now I'm not so sure. Surely he's not looking at the staircase over here. Right, sit. Whoa, shit! Just, just go. Just go. Oh, wow, it worked. Okay, I didn't... Whoa, shit! Creepy. You stay on that side, all right? I'll stay on this one. I haven't really stopped to, to think about what's going on. What the... What was that?